Pfizer's experimental COVID-19 antiviral pill can cut the risk of onding up in the hospital or dying by 89%, and this means that Americans may soon have a choice in COVID-19 pills that they can take at home. The news sent shares of Pfizer PFE, plus 10. 86% soaring 8. 2% in trading on Friday, capping off a week in which the company reported better than expected sales of its COVID-19 vaccine and its oral COVID-19 pill produced compelling results in a clinical trial. As long as you have COVID around, you will H. Merck and Company Incorporated SMRK, minus 9. 86% is also developing a COVID-19 antiviral, which is currently under review at the Food and Drug Administration. Its shares tumbled 8.5% on Friday after Pfizer shared the first late-stage clinical data for its drug, Paxlovid, if either or both of the antivirals are authorized in the coming months, Merck's drug is set to be reviewed by a FDA advisory committee on November 30th, it will change how we care for people who are infected with the virus. Prescribing pills to people at home means those who have medical conditions that put them at high risk of severe COVID-19 don't need to go to clinics to receive infusions, as is necessary for the monoclonal antibodies. It also means that fewer people who get severely ill will end up in the hospital or die. Paxlovid will be a game-changer for the course of the pandemic and should accelerate our return towards our pre-COVID normalcy, RBC Capital Markets analyst Brian Abrahams told investors on Friday. Merck kicked off the wave of antiviral interest in early October when the company announced that the COVID-19 pill it's developing with the privately held Ridgeback Biotherapeutics can reduce the risk of hospitalization and death by 50% among adults who are at high risk of severe disease. This is the first pill to demonstrate it can keep severe illness caused by the virus at bay, and the U.K. on Thursday became the first country to authorize Molna Paravar. Wall Street analysts say that the data for Pfizer's drug indicates that it may work better than the Merck pill, and that Paxlovid's compelling figures are good for most of the COVID-19 antivirals in development.